oh, they want to put, you know, the guy that's hardest to tackle or the guy that made the best catch in the league at number one position. Yes, I know these players play the game. Yes, I know these coaches coach the game. But the truth of, of the matter is they have a biased opinion. They want to put said running back on top of the list simply because of the simple fact of the matter is is that they have to play this guy twice a year and they want to stroke his ego. So when this guy, King Henry, for example, runs over the Indianapolis Colts two, two times this season, of course they want to put him up at the top, put him at number one ranking in their best running backs of 2022. The reason why I bring this up is because we had a troll, my man Joe Tebow, or however the fuck you say his name, I don't really care. Joe, I'm calling you out personally, my man. You said that the players have put King Henry up at number one, and I said three years ago that King Henry would fall off the map. Well, Joe, first things first, Man Hour has only been around for 18 months. Second thing is, King Henry did fall off the map last year. He got injured. That That is a part of falling off the map. Yes, he had a great eight or nine games in the regular season, but what did he do for the rest of the season? Absolutely nothing because he fell off the map because he got hurt. That is falling off the map. Is When you get hurt, you fall off the map. This year, we will, we, we, we will see how it goes. Sorry, stuttering Odie popped up there a, like a little bit. But, Joe, when King Henry is ranked number one by his peers, that is a complete biased opinion. You, you have to look beyond what you've done in the past. How can we say that this person is great now because he did this, this, and this 10 years ago? It doesn't make sense, Joe. It doesn't make sense. That is why JT is the best running back in the league. King Henry is a top 10 running back right now going into 2022. I, I will give you that. He will not be number one because there's a one-two punch now happening in, New e- or, uh, in Tennessee. That is just the way it is, and that's the way it's going to be. King Henry is not the number one running back in the NFL. King Henry is a top 10 running back in the NFL, but he is going to fall off after this season. Like I said, 18 months ago, that he will fall off in three years. This is the third year, Joe. He is coming back from injury, Joe. He is going to have a two-headed monster in the running back, Joe. It is... King Henry falls off after after this year, Joe. He falls off. 